Securing a network based upon privilege level is certainly nothing new. I mean, we've historically done this with applications and user group assignments. <laughs> but hey, that's never enough, right? We also need an access control policy. And then each policy needs its own server, of course, so now scalability gets out of control. <laughs> Wait a minute, I almost forgot. We need to add compliance requirements, which means we're going to need to encrypt the traffic as well, but that's going to cripple existing security methods like deep packet inspection and access control lists. Ugh. This is where Cisco TrustSec comes in. Cisco TrustSec builds security and intelligence into the network with policy-based access control, identity-aware networking, data confidentiality, and data integrity. How? Well, to understand TrustSec, you first have to understand that it is role-based. This means that for every user and device on the network, you must establish not their name or number, but what their job is. TrustSec first starts with making your network role-aware. Now, this is fundamentally different than access control in a DHCP network, which can be very difficult. I mean, think about it. Even in a static IP network, we can end up with huge access control lists that are difficult to process, especially on older gear. Trusic is designed to use the network devices you already have, not ask you to forklift or bolt something on. Since the role of enforcement is actually done at the device level, our first step is to authenticate the device itself within the Trusic framework. This identifies all legitimate devices or roles on your network with the express purpose of keeping rogue devices from entering and being used as an attack vector. Now, once your infrastructure is authenticated, you need to look at two key concepts, security group tags and security group access control lists. SGACLs are the enforcement arm of TrustSec. The advantage of an SGACL over a plain vanilla ACL is that they don't use IP addresses. Now, an SGT is a unique 16-bit tag assigned to each individual role and device that connects it to a TrustSec domain. The tag itself indicates a privilege level across the entire domain. An SGT is passed along dynamically to a switch or an AP after either the 802.1x, the web authentication, or the MAC authentication bypass, which would happen with the RADIUS vendor-specific attribute. SGTs dynamically automate the process of network-wide policy deployment and enforcement. So instead of manually typing entries into an ACL every time, we have a security policy change. I mean, think about the time that's going to save. Of course, any hacker worth their salt is going to try and put their hands on your SGTs so they can deploy their policies in your network. So to ensure confidentiality and integrity, there's also hop-by-hop -hop encryption that's based on 802.1 AE to complete TrustSec. So even if the frames are captured, they don't give up any information. Packets are encrypted on egress and decrypted on ingress. This bump-in-the-line model runs encryption at line rate, prevents reply protection and man-in-the-middle attacks, and it's based on the AES GCM mode. So let's put it all together. Rob and Jimmy Ray need to access the network. Both have different roles, so they start their 802.1x login process. Rob and Jimmy Ray both receive their SGTs after a successful login based upon their role in the network. The switch downloads the policy that it needs only for the users it carries the SGT for, not the entire network policy. Rob's in marketing, Jimmy Ray's in engineering. The roles are enforced at the switch level with the HGACL to ensure access control lists across the entire network. Flexibility and scalability is the key to TrustSec. Cisco supports different roles, access devices, operating systems, and access methods so that you can select from various authentication mechanisms, which are client-based or client-less. In the back end, identity can be mapped to roles or groups using standard directory services or AAA services. Networks have no borders these days. Cisco TrustSec can help you secure a borderless network with confidence, consistency, and efficiency.